Bette Midler, a beloved actress and singer, turned 77 on December 1st, 2022. In this video, we will delve into some of her recent interviews where she shares her biggest career regret. Known for films like Hocus Pocus and The Rose as well as her award-winning music, Midler has led a truly remarkable career. Let's take a closer look at this fascinating topic. Bette Midler, also known as Bathhouse Bet, started her career in Manhattan's Continental Baths. This popular gay bathhouse was where she first performed and gained recognition. Her diverse talents in singing, acting, and comedy quickly set her apart from others and helped her rise to fame. In the 1970s, Midler released her first album, The Divine Miss M, which was a huge success and earned her a Grammy Award. She continued to release popular albums throughout the following decades, showcasing her powerful voice and unique style. Midler's acting career took off in the late 1970s with her breakout role in the film The Rose. Her portrayal of a self-destructive rock star earned her a Golden Globe Award and solidified her status as a talented actress. She went on to star in numerous films, including Beaches, Hocus Pocus, and The First Wives Club. In addition to her singing and acting careers, Midler is also known for her comedic talents. She has hosted her own talk show, appeared on Saturday Night Live, and performed stand-up comedy. Her ability to make people laugh has added another dimension to her already impressive career. Throughout her career, Midler has been recognized with numerous awards, including four Golden Globes, three Grammy Awards, and three Emmy Awards. Her contributions to the entertainment industry have left a lasting impact and continue to be celebrated. Bette Midler's diverse talents and enduring career have made her a beloved figure in the entertainment industry. From her early performances in the Continental Baths to her iconic roles in film and music, Midler has captivated audiences for decades. Her ability to sing, act, and make people laugh has cemented her place as a true entertainer. Bette Midler, a legendary figure in the entertainment industry, recently opened up about her career in a reflective interview. She expressed a sense of fulfillment and contentment with all that she has accomplished in her performing career, indicating that she no longer feels the need to prove herself. This suggests that Midler may be gradually stepping away from the stage. Throughout her career, Midler has made a significant impact on the entertainment industry with her diverse talents. She has excelled in various areas of entertainment, including music, film, and theater. Her work has left a lasting impression, and she has earned a devoted following of fans who appreciate her unique style and undeniable talent. Despite her many accomplishments, Midler does not seem interested in resting on her laurels. Instead, she has expressed a desire to focus on other areas of interest and to give back to the community. This is a testament to her versatility as an individual and her commitment to making a positive impact on the world. While Midler's transition away from the stage may be disappointing for some fans, it is important to remember that all good things must come to an end. Midler has had a long and successful career, and she has earned the right to step back and focus on other areas of her life. Her legacy will live on through her many contributions to the entertainment industry, and she will always be remembered as a true icon. In conclusion, Bette Midler's recent reflections on her career suggest that she may be transitioning away from the stage. While this may be bittersweet for her fans, it is important to remember all that she has accomplished throughout her career. Her contributions to the entertainment industry are immeasurable, and she will always be remembered as a true legend. Bette Midler, the renowned actress and singer, has expressed regret over certain songs she recorded throughout her career. In particular, she has mentioned Married Men and My Night in Black Leather as songs that she didn't favor. Despite having initial hesitation, Midler recorded Wind Beneath My Wings, which later became a significant and impactful song for her career. Married Men and My Night in Black Leather are two songs that Midler has publicly stated she regrets recording. She has expressed that these songs do not accurately reflect her musical style or personal beliefs. However, Midler has also highlighted the importance of Wind Beneath My Wings in her career. Despite initial reservations, Midler recorded the song, and it later became a massive hit, winning several awards and becoming a fan favorite. Throughout her career, Bette Midler has been known for her powerful voice and dynamic performances. With a career spanning over five decades, Midler has released numerous hit songs and starred in a variety of successful films and Broadway productions. Despite her regrets over certain songs, Midler's impact on the music and entertainment industry is undeniable. 
In conclusion, while Bette Midler has expressed regret over recording certain songs, she has also had significant success in her career. Her hit song, Wind Beneath My Wings, has become a classic, and she has left a lasting impact on the music and entertainment industry. Bette Midler is a highly respected and accomplished actress known for her powerful voice and dynamic stage presence. However, she has one regret in her successful career declining the role in the movie Sister Act. The reason for her refusal was her discomfort with the costume, specifically the nun's habit. She found it difficult to relate to the character in that attire, and so she turned down the opportunity. Later, the role went to Whoopi Goldberg, who received widespread acclaim and success for her portrayal of Sister Mary Clarence. Despite her initial reservations, Midler humorously acknowledged that the role could have been a huge success for her too. She has often spoken about this missed opportunity in interviews, expressing her regret with a touch of humor. Midler's regret serves as a reminder that even the most successful and accomplished individuals have regrets and missed opportunities in their careers. However, she has continued to thrive in the entertainment industry with a career spanning over five decades and numerous accolades to her name. Bette Midler is an accomplished actress who has had a long and successful career in the entertainment industry. One notable role that she declined was the lead in the movie Misery due to its violent content. This was a significant decision for Midler, as she has always been mindful of the types of roles she takes on and how they align with her personal values and comfort level. In reflecting on this decision, Midler has stated that it was an important career choice for her. She has often discussed the importance of staying true to oneself and not compromising one's principles for the sake of a role. For Midler, this meant turning down a high-profile opportunity in order to maintain her sense of integrity and peace of mind. Of course, Midler has had many other opportunities throughout her career, and she has taken on a wide variety of roles that have showcased her talents and versatility as an actress. However, her decision to decline the lead role in Misery remains a notable example of her commitment to staying true to herself and her values. It is a testament to her strength and self-awareness as an artist and serves as a reminder that success is not always measured by the roles we take on, but by the choices we make and the principles we uphold. Bette Midler, a highly respected and admired figure in the entertainment industry, has had a long and varied career. Over the years, she has taken on a wide range of roles, some of which she chose out of necessity rather than being fully aligned with her creative aspirations. In a moment of reflection, Midler shared that this has led to a mix of emotions regarding the relationship between these roles and her original goals. While Midler has always been driven by her passion for the arts, there were times when she had to make professional decisions that may not have perfectly matched her creative vision. These choices, however, have given her a diverse portfolio, demonstrating her extraordinary talent and adaptability in various contexts. Throughout her journey, Midler has learned to find value in every role she takes on, even if it doesn't perfectly represent her initial artistic intentions. She understands that every experience contributes to her growth as an artist and individual. Her ability to embrace different challenges has earned her admiration and respect from audiences and industry peers alike. Bette Midler's career is an inspiring example of resilience and versatility in the face of professional challenges. Her willingness to explore diverse opportunities has allowed her to captivate audiences worldwide and leave an indelible mark in the world of entertainment. Though her path may not have always been perfectly aligned with her creative aspirations, Midler's accomplishments and contributions are still something to be cherished and celebrated. Bette Midler, the legendary actress, singer, and comedian, has recently shared her concerns about the current state of the entertainment industry. She pointed out a troubling trend in the movie industry where she observes a growing number of junkie movies being produced. Midler believes that these films lack the substance and quality that older films used to have, which is disappointing for both the audience and the industry professionals. In addition to her critique of the movie industry, Midler also commented on the changing dynamics in the music industry. She noted that the shift in the industry's focus towards less substantial content has affected the overall quality of music being produced. While Midler recognizes the importance of innovation and evolution in music, she feels that the industry should not compromise on the quality and depth of the content it produces. Midler's concerns reflect a broader issue within the entertainment industry, where the demand for commercial success often overshadows the need for artistic excellence. Midler's long and successful career in the industry has allowed her to observe its evolution 
and recognize the shifts that have taken place. Her candid critique serves as a reminder of the importance of maintaining high standards in the entertainment industry, ensuring that it continues to produce meaningful and substantial content for its audience. Bette Midler has always valued the freedom that comes with live performance. Throughout her career, she has faced various challenges in the industry, but has consistently turned to live performances as a platform where she can express herself freely and connect with her audience in a unique way. Unlike studio-driven projects, which often come with strict guidelines and limitations, live performances allow Midler to showcase her talents and improvisational skills in a more spontaneous and unpredictable setting. This artistic freedom is essential to Midler, as it enables her to truly be herself on stage and give her fans an authentic and memorable experience. Midler's love for live performance dates back to her early days in the industry, when she began performing in small clubs and cabarets. It was there that she discovered her passion for singing, acting, and entertaining live audiences. Over the years, she has taken this passion and turned it into a successful career, with numerous sold-out concerts and tours to her name. Despite the challenges she has faced in the industry, Midler has remained committed to her craft and to the freedom that live performance provides. She continues to push boundaries and challenge herself, always striving to create something new and exciting for her audience. In conclusion, Bette Midler's love for live performance and the artistic freedom it provides is a defining aspect of her career. Despite the constraints of studio-driven projects, she has consistently turned to live performances as a way to connect with her audience and express herself in a more spontaneous and unpredictable setting. This dedication to her craft and to her fans is a true testament to her talent and passion as a performer. Bette Midler, the legendary actress and singer, has always prioritized her family alongside her successful career. She has been married to Martin von Hazelberg since 1984, and they share a daughter, Sophie von Hazelberg. Midler has often praised her husband for being a supportive partner and helping her balance her professional and personal life. The proud mother Midler has expressed her interest in having her daughter play her in a potential biopic. She believes that Sophie, an accomplished actor in her own right, could capture her essence and bring her story to life. Midler's decision to suggest her daughter for the role demonstrates her confidence in Sophie's abilities and their close relationship. Midler's family life is a testament to her priorities and values. Despite her demanding career, she has always made time for her loved ones and recognized the importance of a supportive family. Her ability to maintain a healthy work-life balance is a testament to her strength as a person and an artist. Throughout her career, Midler has touched the hearts of millions with her powerful voice and unforgettable performances. Her impact on the entertainment industry is undeniable and her family life is a crucial part of her story. Her dedication to her husband and daughter speaks volumes about her character and the kind of person she is beyond the spotlight. In conclusion, Bette Midler's personal life and family are essential aspects of her story. Her marriage and daughter have provided her with love, support, and inspiration, allowing her to continue thriving in her career. Midler's willingness to involve her daughter in a potential biopic is a beautiful gesture that highlights the importance of family in her life. Bette Midler was born in 1945 in Honolulu, Hawaii, and grew up in a humble household as the daughter of a housewife and a painter. From a young age, Midler showed a keen interest in performing and would often put on shows for her family and neighbors. Despite facing financial struggles, Midler's parents encouraged her to pursue her dreams and she began performing in local productions. After graduating from high school, Midler moved to New York City to attend the prestigious Academy of Dramatic Arts. However, she dropped out after only two months and began performing in off-Broadway shows and as a backup singer for various artists. In the early 1970s, Midler landed her own solo act at the Continental Baths, a popular gay bathhouse in New York City. It was during this time that she began to develop her unique style, combining elements of pop, rock, and cabaret. In 1972, Midler released her debut album, The Divine Miss M, which was a critical and commercial success. The album featured several hit singles, including Do You Wanna Dance and Boogie Woogie Bugle Boy, and earned Midler her first Grammy Award. Over the next few years, Midler continued to release successful albums and establish herself as a fixture in the entertainment industry. In addition to her music career, Midler also began acting in films and on television. She made her film debut in the 1979 comedy The Rose, for which she received a nomination for the Academy Award for Best Actress. 
Throughout the 1980s and 1990s, Midler appeared in several successful films, including Down and Out in Beverly Hills, Beaches, Hocus Pocus, and The First Wives Club. Midler has also had a successful career on Broadway, starring in productions such as Fiddler on the Roof, I'll Eat You Last to Chat with Sue Mingers, and Hello Dolly, for which she won the Tony Award for Best Actress in a Musical in 2017. Throughout her career, Midler has been praised for her versatility and resilience. She has been able to transition seamlessly between music, film, and theater, and has left an indelible mark on each. Her career, spanning six decades, is a testament to her talent and determination. Midler's legacy in the entertainment industry is undeniable, and she continues to inspire and captivate audiences with her unique style and undeniable talent. As we come to the end of our exploration into the life and career of Bette Midler, we'd like to take a moment to reflect on the joy and entertainment she has brought to so many. With a career spanning over five decades, Midler has made an indelible mark on the entertainment industry. Throughout her career, Midler has captivated audiences with her powerful voice, comedic timing, and memorable performances. From her early days in Broadway productions to her successful film and music career, Midler has proven herself to be a truly versatile performer. As we conclude our discussion, we invite you to share your favorite Bette Midler moments and to participate in celebrating her enduring legacy in the entertainment world. Whether you've enjoyed her music, films, or live performances, there is no denying the impact that Midler has had on the entertainment industry and on the hearts of her many fans. So let's take a moment to appreciate the many contributions that Bette Midler has made to the world of entertainment. From her early beginnings to her current status as a beloved icon, Midler has truly left her mark on the entertainment world. Let's continue to celebrate her legacy and all that she has given to the world of entertainment.